was a lawyer, politician, diplomat, and pro football player following a distinguished All-American career at Marquette, Laverne Dilwig is among the most accomplished athletes in the university's illustrious history. Dilwig led the Golden Avalanche football team to two undefeated seasons and an overall record of 28-4-1 during his career in the blue and gold. The Milwaukee native also played center for the basketball team and threw shot put for the track and field squad. After earning All-America honors from Walter Eckersall as a senior, Dilwig participated in the first East-West Shrine game in San Francisco, where he turned in one of the more acclaimed performances in what has become an annual event. Dilwig finished his law degree from Marquette while playing professionally for the Milwaukee Badgers of the NFL in 1926. Once the Badgers folded, Dilwig moved to Green Bay, where he played with the Packers from 1927 to 34 and helped the team to three consecutive league titles, earning all NFL recognition in all but one season. Dilwig was one of the greatest football players in the first decade of the NFL's existence and was included on the league's 17-member All-Decade team for the 1920s. He was joined on that squad by early pro football icons Curly Lambeau, Red Grange, Jim Thorpe, Ernie Nevers, and George Hellas. In a listing of the greatest athletes in the history of the state of Wisconsin, Sports Illustrated proclaimed in 1999 that Dilwig was one of the NFL's first dominant receivers with the Packers in the 1920s. Dilwig also served as a United States Congressman and was appointed to the U.S. Foreign Claims Commission by President John F. Kennedy in 1961. For his contributions to Marquette Athletics, Dilwig is the first M Club Hall of Fame member to posthumously earn induction in more than 30 years.